Hi awesome people, welcome back to my channel, Team Mamba here. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so incredibly much for all of your amazing support. If you are new here, welcome also. We are watching movies here and just having good time. For me personally, watching a movie and sipping on my favorite cup of tea uh, goes really well with my quite nerdy personality, so yeah, I really love doing this. So I've just recently finished watching the main trilogy of Star Wars Saga and now I'm more than ready to dive into the prequel series and discover how some of those characters that we've met already in the original trilogy, how they have been developing and probably what events have led to forming their personalities as we know them for now. So yeah, I'm really stoked to watch the first episode of the prequel series and today guys we're watching episode 1, The Phantom Menace. Grab your favorite drink, grab your favorite snack. I have already my tea and my snacks prepared since the movie is pretty long. So yeah, and let's jump in and let's go! Yeah! Okay. <gasps> I have a bad feeling about this. Oh! I don't sense anything. It's not about the mission master. It's something. <laughs> I have a bad feeling about this. Is it young Captain Solo? Ah, oh, it's Obi Wan. For some reason, I thought it's Captain Solo because he said this phrase. Like, I have a bad feeling about this. <laughs> Send a droid. Ooh. Oh no, Woodward. I'm somehow really happy that the main role is played by Liam Neeson and Ian McGregor. Those are like fantastic actors, as far as I'm concerned. So yeah, I'm actually already excited, already stoked for this movie, because I love both both of these actors. Hmm. My lord, is that legal? I will make it legal. <laughs> Oh no! How did it even happen? Oh my jeez! What a start! What a start! Roger, Roger! Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Yeah, of course, uh, the first observation also you can see such a drastic difference in graphics uh, between the old uh, trilogy and yeah this uh, prequel series, so it's like 1999 and already such a astonishing difference in graphic and computer design in the film. But yet, I'm still, I'm still impressed. Uh, what has been created in 1977? Whoa! Oh, it's melting! I mean, the saber, this, this saber is so powerful. Let's go. Those guys have pretty cool shields. Oh. Quite awesome. Let's split up. Stow aboard separate ships and meet oh. Down oh, I don't like the idea when uh, main heroes are splitting up. Federation's gone too far this time. So played by Natalie Portman. Yeah. Hmm. By the way, Natalie Portman is also a good actress. I will not condone a course of action that will lead us to war. Uh, Her Highness has a very beautiful costume. Hmm. I must admit, very nice. <laughs> no, no, Mr. Stan, Mr. Your humble servant. At one. It's, it is demanded by the gods. It is. <laughs> oh, that grandma though. <laughs> so <laughs> at least I don't. <laughs> I'm not alone in speaking not very proper <laughs> English here. <laughs> oh no. That guy's funny. Those ears also. Do do flop ears. <laughs> How much further? We are going underwater, okay? Underwater. <laughs> so this creature is living underwater, right? Okay. Yeah, he quite looked like uh, the one who's. Whoa. Whoa! This is a whole underwater universe. Looking cool. I like their breathing equipment uh, to sustain oxygen in the water. It's kind of innovative. <laughs> wow. They think their brain so big. Once those droids. Ooh. 
through the planet core? Seriously? <laughs> yeah, bad idea going through the planet core, huh? <laughs> oh, that is a huge fish chasing them. Massive one. Oh, <laughs> that's a that's a big fishy right there. <laughs> what? It looks like more like dinosaur rather than a fish. Power's back. <gasps> wow! Natural predator prey evolution in the underwater world, right? Okay. Thank you, Ambassador. But my place is with my people. It will kill you if you stay. Excuse me? Excuse me? I just noticed. Uh, this is... This is um, one actress, but this actress looked the same. I remember there was another popular actress apart from Natalie Portman here. Hmm, okay. Okay, just let's explore further. They will probably... Reveal it? Yes, they are the, almost the same faces. But they are different actress actresses, right? The queen had a, like a twin for some or something, or I'm so confused. Hmm. Ooh, that uh, that guy looks freaky. Without a doubt, it huh? saved the ship as well as our lives. R two D two, your highness. R two D two, yay! <laughs> our friend. Cutie. This is this is Natalie Portman. I remember the second actress. It's Kira Knightley. Okay, but now I'm confused. Okay, Natalie. Natalie Portman is a part of me of the Queen. The Queen is Kira Knightley, right? No idea <laughs> whatsoever. <laughs> but I from okay, okay. Maybe I mix something in my head. So I it is a bit confusing because in the very first uh, shot in this movie, in the very beginning when they showed uh, the Queen, the Queen looked like Natalie Portman, but not like Kira Knightley. So yeah, okay, never mind. Are you an angel? What? An angel? Huh? I heard the deep space pilots talk about that. I'm a person, and my name is Anakin. <gasps> Anakin. <gasps> is it? Is it looks father? Oh, it's look father, and he's like a little boy. No money, no parts, no deal. <laughs> no money, no deal. Okay, <laughs> he's pretty straightforward. <laughs> oh! Oh my God! Nevertheless, the boy is right. You are heading into trouble. If the trace was correct. You will then have no difficulty in taking the Queen to Naboo to sign the treaty. We must survive on our own. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> nice way of eating apples. <laughs> Three Pew. Three Pew. Isn't he great? <gasps> what a genius boy! He constructed Three Pew himself. Whoa. Protocol drew it to help mom. <laughs> so sweet. What do you mean I'm naked? <laughs> Best buddies met each other. I got the racer. Fastest ever. Ooh. There's big race tomorrow on Bunta E. He built the racer himself. Wow. You should be very proud of your son. He gives without any thought of reward. Special powers. Mm, yeah, special powers indeed. The horse is unusually strong with him. That much is clear. Hmm. There was no no father? How? Okay. <laughs> Anakin warned you, man! <laughs> so clumsy. He's clumsy indeed. I'm sure you're good this time. Do what? Finish the race, of course. Oh! He never won a race. He never won a well... race. Of course you will. Hmm, okay. I'm assuming he's gonna win. With the help of somebody, right? <gasps> oh, what a sneaky 
Sneaky bastard! What did he do to the, the race car? Jabba hat! Ow! I don't like him. Nasty bastard, that guy, huh? Jabu is sleeping. <laughs> Jabu was just sleeping. <laughs> yeah, why not? Just having a nap. I'm no longer a slave. <gasps> Did you hear that? Now you can make your dreams come true and to I'm gonna with you on your starship. Exciting, right? Poor mom though. What about mom? Poor mom. <laughs> Sleep you. I would prefer I would I would prefer I was a bit more completed. <laughs> oh poor mom. Mother's heart is mother's heart. Oh no. So sweet. The queen, the, the queen is pretty hot. <laughs> the costume of, of the queen, again, I'm repeating myself, is really, really beautiful. And this um, cosmetics, is it? I wonder if the costume was inspired by some Japanese style. It really looks like um, something very Japan related. This particular, this particular costume. My only conclusion can be that it was the Sith Lord and part of them. The Sith have been extinct for a millennium. We will discover the identity of your attacker. Samuel Jackson is in here. Yay! I love that actor. <laughs> That's really cool. Hmm. So Sith, they called Sith. Sith or Sith? Is it like a dark side? Um, there's a Jedi and there's the Sith. Hmm. What is the what is this test about? <laughs> your thoughts dwell on your mother. Afraid to lose her, I think. Here is the path to the dark side. Yoda says uh, he feels his fear. So perhaps that fear would lead him to uh, to the dark side eventually. Anakin becoming Darth Vader, right? Mm. I will sign no treaty, Senator. My fate will be no different from that of our people. Clouded this boy's future is. Oh. Yoda already could feel and predict <clears throat> that Anakin's future is gonna be pretty dark. Without the Midichlorians, life could not exist, and we would have no knowledge of the Force. Your Honor. Who signed you? I am Queen Amidala. <gasps> She's the Queen! Now it all makes sense in my head because I had a great confusion about it. Oh, general! Wow! <laughs> he passed out after the news. <laughs> oh! Uh oh! I'm not sure how the Gungans are gonna fight against like dark 
dark side because they have such a such a crazy dangerous army okay actually two oh what are those what are those things oh there's so many of them oh. <laughs> Jesus he's so clumsy he's so clumsy whoa he has a double saber double one kind of Wow, that guy has cool makeup though. <laughs> He's really so clumsy, man. Brave Anakin. Brave young Anakin. Went to the war, young guy. Oh. Whoa, that looks beautiful. Oh no! No! Obi-Wan! Obi-Wan, hold on there! What's happening? Why isn't he fighting? Oh no! They're surrounded! Oh no, he's stuck there. Oh no. That guy's really powerful. Oh no! What a nasty, nasty guy! Yes. <laughs> oh no. He can use this, he can use force to get that saber. <gasps> yes. Yes, 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 yes. Kill him. Yes. Yes, perfect. No. Oh no. He is the chosen one. Hmm. We will watch your career with great interest. <gasps> ah, that is the epic phrase. We will watch your career with great interest, right? Yeah. Well, I don't believe in him. Nevertheless, grave danger I fear in his training. Hmm. Yoda is really skeptical about young Anakin future. He's not happy. Yoda is not. Yoda is not happy with this decision, right? Okay. The master and the apprentice. They're talking about Sith. Yeah. <gasps> and who, yeah, who was destroyed? Who was destroyed? So oh, that's the question. That's a big question. What a journey it has been. Oh well, uh, I would say that this particular movie or maybe this particular part was not as emotional uh, compared to the parts which I've encountered in the original trilogy. Uh, trilogy. Um, so yeah, the spectrum of emotions is was a bit less uh, in this particular movie. Yeah, compared to each of the parts or each of the movies from the original trilogy, those were way more emotional for me. That's my first observation. Um, yeah, of course, the graphics is much better here. And um, yeah, the the actors, uh, the actor crew is really good. Like, I, I'm very, I'm very happy that I saw Liam Neeson in this movie and this Ian, Ian McGregor and Natalie Portman. So yeah, uh, there are quite a few pluses. Uh, yeah, beautifully, beautifully short movie. Uh, Story-wise, yeah, I'm very stoked and really looking forward to seeing what uh, will be happening to young Anakin and how he will be developed and trained to become a Jedi and eventually how uh, he will be dragged to the dark side. Uh, because as we know, yeah, um, this is his future is to become Darth Vader, unfortunately. 
Mm, so yeah. Mm, yeah, and of course I'm I'm very looking forward and stoked to see where looks come from. <laughs> and um obviously Anakin will have a wife or I don't know, it's something uh at the very last scene there was something happening between this um queen and young Anakin. So my, my assumption is that probably they will be together. I don't know. I, I'm not sure, but just assuming and uh, making some predictions. But anyway, yeah, guys, it was a good movie. It was a good movie. Yeah, I'm. I want to see. I want to see how our young Anakin will become the bad guy. That's really exciting. Yeah. So yeah, hope you enjoyed. Hope you enjoyed this journey with me today. Hope you had a great time. I did. I did have a good time. I did have a good time watching this movie. Um. So yeah. Please, guys, um, I wish you all the best, stay safe, take care, stay, be healthy, and I will see you in the next reaction video. So, yeah, most likely episode 2 of Star Wars Saga. Yeah. Okay, guys, um, we'll see you in next video. Bye!